Hello everybody, this is Hobo, your favorite starving gamer, here to continue playing through Antstream Arcade's library of more than 1,300 retro video games. Today is day 33, and each day I play four or five games and give them a simple rating just to indicate how likely I am to play them again after the first time playing them on this platform. And we have another Boulder Dash 2. We have two versions of Boulder Dash two and three versions of boulder dash three so we'll play through those today and uh, this was released in 1985 by first star software and this is the spectrum version And it, it's more of the same. Although the scrolling seems particularly slow in this version compared to the first Spectrum uh, Boulder Dash 1. But same thing, you dig your way, try not to get smashed by boulders, avoid these uh, enemies. Yeah, we'll play it a little bit more on the uh, Commodore 64 version. So that is Boulder Dash 3, or sorry, Boulder Dash 2 for the Spectrum, released a year after Boulder Dash 1. So, I mean, really, it's more of like what you would think of a DLC, just more levels, pretty much the same thing. So I'm going to give that a, a 4 or 5 out of 10. Just the scrolling's worse than the first one, so won't be playing that one again. And... Up next, we have Boulder Dash 2 for the Commodore 64. So it loads faster than the Spectrum. Graphics are a little better. And... Uh, Scrolls, scrolls way better. This, this first level is much tougher than the first level in Boulder Dash 1. Dang it. Alright, last life. Yeah, you know, more of the same. Like I said, it'd be more of considered like a DLC today, just additional levels released the year later after the first one. But, you know, a classic, so I'll give that a 7 out of 10. Good chance I'll play that again. And up next, we have Boulder Dash 3 for the Spectrum. And this was released a year after Boulder Dash 2. Um... So this one's black and white, at least the first level. And it's even slower to start or than the second one. And the scrolling, you know, I think, is even worse. Like maybe 
the seizure the scrolling is so bad. And there are a lot of diamonds. Anyway, I'm going to have a seizure if I keep playing that. So, again, more of the same. Boulder Dash 3 for the Spectrum. Um, scrolling is just terrible. So, I'm going to give that a 4 out of 10. Don't think I'll be playing that again. On the Spectrum, at least. And then we have Boulder Dash 3 for the Amstrad CPC. That is a lot of diamonds. So this one is very similar to the uh, Spectrum version, at least graphically. Controls are a little more responsive. Scrolls better, not as good as the Commodore 64. Scrolls a lot better than the Spectrum version. Man, there's so many diamonds. And there's a time limit. Different type of puzzle in three. Lots of diamonds. Does that mean I open the exit somewhere? That flashing? Oh, man. Oh, man. I think I screwed myself. Definitely did. There's another way to get over there. I'm assuming the exit's in the bottom left corner. No, I don't see the exit. Where's, where is the exit? I guess maybe I haven't opened it yet. And I can't get over there this way. Out of time. Rip. All right. Well, that is Boulder Dash Three for the Amstrad CPC. Not bad. Um, a lot better than the Spectrum. Um, so you know, I'll give that like a six out of ten. 
might play that again maybe on this version just for the heck of it but uh, i'd probably play the commodore 64 version which is up next Loads quickly. Once. Actually, I think the controls are a little more responsive with the Amstrad. Scrolling is the best on the Commodore. But it went too bad in the Amstrad, so that might be the version I play of Balder Dash 3. Kind of zone out sometimes, and that's not good in this game. Must get the diamonds. What is that? Something going on with the graphics? Yeah, I don't know. out of time. Game over. All right, well, that was Boulder Dash 3 for the Commodore 64. Uh, pretty good, about as good as the Amstrad CPC version, but um, I'm going to give that a 7 out of 10, and I'm going to bump up my score for the Amstrad up to a 7 out of 10, too. So I said 6 earlier. But uh, that is our three games for today. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy the video, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and have a good day.